Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about Monster Hunter Rise. I did a video way back in the day, not that long ago actually. Look look at my uh, YouTube studio. So my first video I published on June 12th and it was uh, Tears of the Kingdom on Yuzu Best Settings. And then on the same day, I actually did three videos. And the third video was modding Monster Hunter Rise. So it's way back. So the video is here, look at the thumbnail. Uh, not that great looking back at it, but yeah. Um, and also this doesn't have voiceover. So uh, you can check it out if you want. Uh, if you're into modding Monster Hunter Rise, so um, this shows you how to install ReFramework um, and it, you can add plugins to get like infinite health, infinite money, stuff like that. So, and then I was reading through the comments. I've got a comment because I've got a comment today. Let's take a look. Uh, yeah, one hour ago, this guy, Alexander Stangelmeer, I think I got your name right. So he wanted to know how to install Fluffy and I have it already, So, but I never did a video. So I thought it was really easy. So I'm just gonna make a quick video. And then I realized that I missed someone's uh, message here. Uh, two months ago, he said, um, this guy Wolfgang Gusta Hop Hills Mussart, something like that, yeah. So he said, is it the same process for Fluffy? And I missed it, so I just replied him. Yeah, sorry for the late reply. So yeah, shout out to both of you guys. So let's get started. Okay, so first thing you do, you go to Nexus Mods, and I'll leave a link in the description. Download Fluffy Manager. Files. Um, yeah, you just download this. Fluffy Manager. I already have it. My one's pretty old, so I'm just going to use the old one. So I'm going to go to Steam and then add a game, add a non-Steam game. Browse. And then go to downloads. Oh no, no, I have it in my I have it in my SD card. That's how long it's been. So here it is. Fluffy manager. Five uh five thousand. And then I'm gonna add the mod manager.exe. Okay. Add selected programs. And then on the left hand side here, you can see mod manager.exe. So I'm gonna to go to properties. I'm gonna change the name to fluffy mod manager i think it's called fluffy 5000 yeah something like that all right and then compatibility i'm going to change it to proton experimental okay click play all right so it's found my Monster Hunter Rise because I think I've I've connected it before. You could if you if you don't, you have to locate the location for your game. So I think something like here, choose game, and you can choose game. So like let's say King of Fighters, and then here it, it doesn't have the I don't have the game. So you just click choose the game folder and you can choose the games executable. So locate your games executable. So I already have Monster Hunter Rise connected. It's here. It's connected here at the bottom. Home deck. Yeah, it's on my yeah, it's on my Steam. So I recognized it, I guess. Okay, and then refresh. I have it. I don't have any mods at the moment. So once you have this installed and your name, uh, your game is connected to it, it, like you've directed the the location of your game. Go to your browser again. And then go to Monster Hunter Rise. And I've, I'm going to add this mod. This mod is called 2B. So it's um it's near Automata. The games, like I could change the skin of the character. So I can be 2B. And this is a big file. It has, like You can replace the NPCs if you want. You don't have to replace yourself. But yeah, I want to like wear her clothes. So I'm going to change um, my Akuma set. Uh, skin so i don't have akuma anymore so if i install this i don't have akuma anymore okay so i've already downloaded it just go here and i'm gonna leave a link in the description just go to files and download files and manual download so i've downloaded it here to be oh what this is pretty sick i just looked at it it's like the downloads 14.6 megabytes 
Then when you unzip it, look at it, look at all the files inside and I highlight them all. It's a 1.9 gigabyte. So they compressed the 1.9 gigabyte file into 14.6 megabytes. Yeah, I don't know how that's done. Wow, crazy stuff. So anyway, so go back into your fluffy manager folder and then go into the games folder and then once down the rise and then there should be a mods folder. So we're going to unzip it here. I'm not going to unzip everything because I don't need them all. I'm just going to use um, this one, Akuma. So she's got an eye, like I'm going to change Akuma's clothes, like her, the layered settings. And then I'm going to use this one, the eye mask. So she, uh, the girl has eye mask and she's wearing a skirt. Okay, so just going to drag it here. Okay. So go back to Fluffy and then refresh the mod list and you see the, the mods here. So I'm going to turn it on. So you turn it on and it does its thing. It copies the files, I think. And then I'm going to launch the game. So that's it, guys. That's that's how easy it is. I think this mod's mostly for um, like uh, cosmetic stuff. The free, free frameworks more on the like cheat cheat stuff like infinite health infinite money and this fluffy manager works for a lot of games a lot of uh capcom games like uh, resident evil 4 uh, devil may cry stuff like that see i've got reframe work also loaded here so if you want reframe work you want to know how it's done on the steam deck you check out the video but sorry that video is like doesn't have sound I didn't do a voiceover for that. It's just uh, captions. So you might have to follow along. Okay, so it's gonna take a bit for Monster Hunter Rise to um, load up. So Monster Hunter is actually one of my favorite franchises. I've been playing since the PSP. Yeah, because that's why I made the third video on my channel is Monster Hunter. Because yeah, it's one of my favorites. Monster Hunter World is my favorite Monster Hunter game. Okay, so if, okay, reframe works loaded here. You can see I could load the like uh, I haven't used this for a while. Uh, yeah, see here, infinite health. Yeah, you can you can add other scripts to it to do other things. But yeah, here, here's infinite health. Is that all I got? Uh, script runner. Yeah, I think that's all I got working. All right, never mind this. Let's go back to our cosmetic, the fluffy mod. See, I'm using um, the layered armor for Arthur. Uh, I've got to change it to Akuma before I can use, like, before I can change into the cosmetic thing. All right, let's go. Let's go. All right, go into your chest, and then I'm gonna change my layered armor. Change layered armor equipment. So I'm gonna change, the, yeah, I'm gonna change the Akuma. And you can see now I'm 2B from Nia. And you can also change the NPC. So like, I think these ones, like you can change them, whichever one. The mod has all the files inside. So if you wanna change NPC, you can also do that. So yeah, it looks pretty cool. You can actually change her voice as well. Uh, because I'm a male character and like the voice is male. So it'll be kind of weird if I'm using this. But yeah, you can change it as well. So pretty cool, huh? So let me know in the comments uh, if this helped you out. And yeah, leave a like and subscribe. See you guys in the next one. Later.